A lot of people, a lot of medical schools these days are starting to require internships or heavily suggest that students perform research internships. It's not because this is a check that they're supposed to cross off to prove that they're worthy. I think it's really because the skills that they're going to develop and learn during that internship experience are ones that are going to make them successful in their professional schools or in their graduate schools. We've had many students say this was the best educational experience of my life. So we have this internship program. So undergraduate students from BYUI will come down and they'll spend three months in the lab. Sometimes uh, in my lab, sometimes one student, sometimes two students. And they're a tremendous asset to the lab. So I suppose from their end of things, they get some experience. They get some hands-on experience in a research laboratory. And then from my perspective, it's like we have another graduate student because I, I find that many of the undergrads function at the level of a beginning graduate student. What this program provides for the students is number one, an association with a mentor. One of the things that we found with these research professors is that they'll get anywhere from 15 to 20 requests a week from their own students or other students to serve as an intern in their lab and most of those they delete because they get so many they can't screen them it's not worth their time so one of the first things that we provide is contact and association with these mentors we do the screening for the mentors and because we do that they're willing to accept whoever we choose to send them and so our students can come to us we can go to the mentors and we can facilitate that student to mentor relationship The internship program is an opportunity that most undergraduate students won't get. And so in order to have an apartment taken care of, your transportation taken care of, and all you have to do is show up and go to work and tell them that you're going to work hard and do that, is, it's amazing. There's nothing else like it. I think the biggest kind of students that we're looking for are students that are motivated. There's other students at these campuses that have training and have skills. It's really the hard work and the motivation that these students bring. That's what we want. BYU-Idaho students should come to UC Davis for internship opportunities because you don't get experiences like this anywhere else. UC Davis is a top-notch research university. Um, it's in the top 10 in the United States in terms of public research funding. It's world-renowned, especially in the biomedical sciences. And uh, coming to UC Davis for an internship is a really unique experience for undergraduates. When the students come down to Davis, we have the apartment already taken care of. The apartment is fully furnished with every from, from silverware to vacuum to ironing board. Everything is there for them. In fact, one of the primary modes of transportation in Davis is bicycles, and we include a full set of bikes with the apartment. Now the students are still going to pay for the cost of the apartment, but that cost is going to be lowered because the students are equally sharing in that cost together. All the students need when they come down is to worry about their own clothing and personal items. The other thing that we do is we often will provide travel to the students and the students will come down in a van, get to know their professors along the way. When we get down to Davis, we're going to show the students around. We're going to show them where the institute building is. We're going to show them where they're going to go to church and what time they go to church at. We're going to tell them who their bishop is and what the environment's like. These types of things lower the anxiety of the student. It makes it feel more like home. The ward here is great. It's a very close-knit group, so people are inviting you to everything. You're half an hour away from most anything you could want to do. The cost of the internship were what I expected and they were manageable and they were nothing compared to the experience that I gained. It was explained to me that this internship was relatively inexpensive for the experience that I'll be getting and I really feel like if I put the work in that I'm going to get a lot out of it. But just the experience and the opportunity to learn new things 
is worth it to me. Students shouldn't be concerned about making mistakes in their internship. I believe that the way to learn is to make mistakes. So I think everyone's going to make mistakes and as long as you learn from that, that's I think doing your job. I just met Veronica Martinez and I'm really excited to start in her lab. The research sounds incredible. I have no idea what I'll be doing and I've heard her say several times that it's okay to make mistakes, they almost expect it. One of the greatest things about Davis is the weather. It's sunny here most of the days of the year, but you're also going to find a community that has a, a strong sense of family and a strong sense of community. They have farmers markets twice a week where the community gathers together and they shop and they buy but they also talk together and they play frisbee out on the community parks and say hi to each other and greet each other and it's just a very warm atmosphere. When we sent our first intern down, Bobby Jane Stoffer, she went in had very little preparation, we didn't do anything for her. Basically said, here's a name and a number, they're expecting you in a couple weeks. So I packed up my stuff from BYU-Idaho and came to UC Davis and started the internship for 10 weeks. Then realized that I really found joy in doing this and wanted to continue on and knew I wanted to apply for grad schools for sure. So I talked to the people in my lab and they wrote me recommendation letters and they actually offered me a job to stay and work as a lab technician and then applied to graduate school here at UC Davis and was accepted, so I started this fall. It's an investment, a personal investment for you, and it's going to be one that will influence you forever.